Hey friends, my name is Nick Cardiff and I am going to talk to you today about why I like to carry around a notebook. There are three reasons. The first, ideas. Now, anybody can have an idea. Most ideas are bad, but if you write them down, you have a better chance of remembering the good ones. Ideas can be anything. Most of the time, you'll probably figure out how to solve a problem. I just figured out how to fix my TV. I just figured out how to make a bridge. I know how to fly. Or if you're a writer like me, maybe some cool slam poetry lines. Let's see what we have here. Talkity, 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 talk. Your head is higher than Jack on his beanstalk. Burn! Ideas are good, so have them. Number two, stealing. I know not everybody is an artist, but I'm going to share a quote. Good artists copy, great artists steal. So I'm not telling you to go out and steal. What it means is, take someone else's idea and make it better. Think about it this way. You're sitting in Starbucks, having your Frappuccino, when you can't help but overhear the table next to you. The young woman says, Bill, it smelled like a bunny fart. Now, was bunny fart your idea? But are you gonna steal it? Oh yeah! So remember, keep your ears on, because you never know when you're going to hear your next great idea. Number three, documentation. Now, documentation is split up into two parts, the past and the future. Part one, the past. Documenting the past is very important. How many days have you been alive? What did you do 17 days ago? How did you feel about it? Who did you talk to? What did you eat? Who did you talk to while you ate and how did you feel about it? Now, you might be asking yourself, does it even matter what I felt 17 days ago? Duh! 11.43 p.m. December 11th, 2006. Were you guys even born yet? I think I just may have had a slight revelation. It's kind of a lame cliche one. After I'm done here at ISU, I think I have to go to the city. A city. I don't care which one. I have to make my music in theater. Oh my god, that's what I did! It's important to know who we were, and documenting your past can help you do that. Part two of documentation, the future. I like to make to-do lists. Tie my cereal, water the cat, watch the Bulls game. Organizing your future is good for you. So when you look into your past, you don't think you were a crazy person. You guys are doing great. Let's do a quick recap. I carry around a notebook to, one, write down my ideas, two, steal things. And three, document my past and organize my future. Thanks for playing along, guys. Now back to your regularly scheduled teacher.